We now have operations in seven different locations across Thailand, and on any given night, we provide a safe home to over 300 children. Last year, the directors of our homes and carers at our homes provided in excess of 320,000 meals. All of that is nice, but that is not the true measure of our success. Because the true measure of our success for us will be when our children leave our homes and enter into careers rather than jobs that just sustain their life. And this is a type of change that will not only impact their lives, but the lives of their children and the following generation. And this will be the true measure of our success. It's a home for uh, kids who uh, have HIV or who have lost their parents to HIV. We've uh, been putting in place a, a pen for, uh, for chickens and ducks and, and also building a, a pig pen. Each of the projects we put in place here, the design is to make them more self-sufficient, less reliant upon donors' money, and then to even sell the produce uh, into the community. For us as the Australian group to come up on the, on the program and to be spending time and interacting, it's been such a, a valuable experience. So what we've got here is, uh, it's the team on the Social Venture Program and we're in the middle of the, the Pong Tui slums and those that support uh, charity find it easy to support uh, kids and uh, but often who's left behind are the elderly and, and the disabled. So what we're doing is making a difference to uh, one family today and what we'll have is some builders who will come in over the next six weeks and build them a new home. So what we can see is that uh, uh, just the timber boards are above the water here which is uh, uh, you know it's uh, it, it, in in the rains and so forth it doesn't take much for for this area to flood if you've joined us for a ride in Thailand as part of the January rides the FBA rides the vision critical rides and if you've been part of the Australian ride please also stand as you are the lifeblood behind the annual funding. Now this year we're on track to pass the $15 million mark of funds raised, and 10 years on, we retain the position that 100% of donors' funds are committed to the children and the projects that we run in Thailand without spending a cent of donors' money on administration or fundraising. Part of our practice is that if you want to bring about long-term change, you certainly need to make long-term commitments. 